Hi there. I don't know about you, but I'm excited to get on the road again. And if you're considering a trip anytime soon, you may want to consider having a pre-trip inspection performed on your vehicle. I'm Joe Hyde, Director of Automotive Technology for Christian Brothers Automotive. Let's talk cars. So let's go take a look under the hood and look at some of these pre-trip inspection items that you may need to check. So first up on your pre-trip inspection, you wanna give the vehicle a good visual inspection. You just wanna kinda of walk around the vehicle and see if you notice anything that is considered abnormal. Maybe a low tire, cracked windshield, things of that nature are things that you wanna look for. Next up after that, we wanna check the fluids under the hood. First up will be our oil. Usually you'll find that most vehicles have an indicator. It'll be indicated by a yellow handle and you simply wanna grasp it firmly Use a paper towel or a shop rag and check it and make sure it's within operating range. Next on the fluid list for our pre-trip inspection is gonna be the cooling system. And usually on today's modern cooling systems, you'll find what they call a degas or a reservoir bottle. Now this is just a visual inspection and we just wanna make sure that it's within the minimum to the maximum operating range as you can see here. Many of today's modern vehicles do not have a way to check your transmission fluid, as in the case of the vehicle that we have here today. Please check your owner's manual to make sure that you don't need to check your transmission fluid before any trips. Another fluid on our inspection list is a visual inspection of where the brake fluid level is, and it can be found under the hood as well. Here, we're just checking to make sure that the fluid is in the operational range between min and max. And in this case, the vehicle is at the normal level. In the event that you find any of the fluids are not within operating range, it's a great time to schedule an appointment with your local Christian Brothers Automotive so that you can have that serviced appropriately. Now we're gonna check the condition of our wiper blades and making sure that we have enough washer fluid for the vehicle. Usually your washer fluid can be found and indicated with a blue cap underneath the engine compartment Simply lift the lid and fill to the desired fill level. Now we're gonna check the condition of the wiper blades and we just wanna lift up gently and we just may wanna make sure that there's no nicks, cuts, splits, and that it feels kinda of soft to the touch. And my recommendation when it comes to wiper blades is when there's a change of season, it's usually a good time to change those wiper blades out. Next on our inspection list, we're gonna visually inspect our battery. Here, we're just making sure that it looks normal and you don't have a science project growing out of it. So in this vehicle, this is where the battery is located. So I'm gently gonna pull the cover back off of the battery post and I'm just gonna look at it. It looks nice and clean. I'm gonna feel it with my hand, it feels nice and tight. I'm gonna place the cover back over it. And then if you can reach it and it's safe to do so, you can check the ground cable as well and it feels good. One of the most important things on our pre-trip inspection is our tires and the tire pressure. Most vehicles today have a sticker that tells you how much air pressure should be in your vehicle. If you look on the inside of the door frame on most of today's vehicles, you'll find the tire inflation certification label. This is the recommendation of the proper air pressure for this particular vehicle according to the manufacturer. When checking your tires, make sure that you always check your spare. You can consult your owner's manual for more information about where your spare is located and what the proper inflation should be. But before those long travel trips, you wanna make sure that your spare is properly inflated, that you have a lug wrench to be able to change the tire and a jack to be able to lift the vehicle. Many of the items on our pre-trip inspection are certainly things you can handle yourself at home. But in the event that you find any concerns or need further inspection of your vehicle, the ASC certified technicians at Christian Brothers Automotive are certainly available for assistance. I'm Joe Hyde, and this has been another edition of Let's Talk Cars.